Hello everybody, and welcome to Don't Starve, Xbox 360 Giant Edition. Now, I downloaded this game the other day, and I thought it would be quite good fun to actually play it with you guys. So, this might be my first ever walkthrough of this game. Hopefully you guys will enjoy it, and if you do, make sure you smash that like button as hard as you can. Break your computer, it doesn't matter, just hit it. Hit it as hard as you can. So I'm going to jump in, and I'm going to press A, straight away. Yes, I'm Phoenix, of course I am, and thank you for joining us. We're going to press play. I've already played this game once or twice, and I've tried to get as far as possible. As you can see, I've got to uh, uh, day 22, I think it was, and I am still alive, but barely. So, if all you Minecraft survivalists out there, you probably enjoy this game quite a lot. So, it's a survival-based game. Don't get the Don't Starve part mixed up. It's not a game about eating, it's not a hot dog competition or anything like that. So we're going to go in on our first day and we're going to start a new game together. I'm going to turn off Reign of Giants because this is the Reign of Giants edition. Now Reign of Giants is pretty much a hardcore mode. And we don't want to do that one up one bit because we are not good players at this game so far. We need to at least do our first ever playthrough and see if we can't get far enough where we can start calling ourselves pros. So we're going to jump into it, we're going to start a whole new game with our new character, Wilson. This game is on the Xbox, I think it's Xbox One, it's on the Xbox One store for about £11.99 and it is a fun game. You can play it over and over and over and over and over again because you cannot complete the game. You simply have to survive as long as you possibly can before you die and I'm pretty sure you cannot complete the game. Now don't quote me on that because I know absolutely nothing about this game. <laughs> uh, I know that we have to complete certain things to be able to survive. We have to go around, collect food, collect resources, build ourselves a base. So what we're going to do is start gathering as much as we can because the first thing you do in the first few days of this game is hoard as much stuff as you can possibly find. Now everything on here is pretty much your foe. I'm foe, but they're my foes. They are not friendlies. We got rabbits, we got birds, stuff like that. They won't attack you. But pretty much everything else that isn't a rabbit or a bird is going to attack you. So you have to stay away from them as much as you possibly can. So if you look up in the top right corner, we have like a little compass thing saying day one. Now that's divided into three separate colors over there. We got a yellow, which is our daytime. We got a red, which is our dusk. And we have blue, which is our nighttime. And we need to make sure that we go around and gather as much resources before it hits nighttime. We don't want to get caught out there in the dark with no resources. Because at nighttime is when all the bad guys come out. And we're going to head over here. We're going to gather as much sticks as we possibly can. No, I didn't even grab that one. My bad. So I'm going to grab a grass, stick, stuff like that. I need to find flint. I can see flint in the top corner of the map. We're going to make ourselves an axe. So that we can cut down some trees. Got ourselves some wood. I'm going to keep heading up here. Okay, I'm gathering some good resources now, guys. I think I need one more flint before I can make myself an axe. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. If you see food on this game, do not walk past it. Pick it up. You're going to need it. Trust me. So let's keep going. We'll gather these berries. We're going to get... Hey. Hey. There we go. We got some flint. We got more than enough flint. So we're going to craft ourselves an axe. And we're going to cut down some trees. We're going to... What's that? What was that? Okay, we're going to go find out what that was. <laughs> I kind of broke character there, guys. I'm going to jump down here and see if I can't find out what that was. Where'd it go? I don't know where that was. Oh, there he is. Come here, you. It's a turkey. It's Christmas. I need a turkey. Come, come here, man. It's too quick. It's... Nah. Okay, then. I can't seem to catch that turkey. I'm going to head down this way. And see if I can find myself some good stuff. I need rocks. I need to find myself some rocks. I'll just keep heading down this way. As far as I can pass. Is it, is it going to end soon? 
kind of looks like it's gonna win. Come on, guys, let's root for some rocks. We need some. Ooh, what? Ooh, piece of candy. What is this? Let's keep heading up north. See if we can't find anything. Hmm. There's lots. Ooh, ooh, that's the sort of. Uh, there's nothing. Ooh. Oh, hello there, Mr. Piggy. Caligula is now. <laughs> What a name you've got there! Oh, there's a rock. We need that rock. I don't know what this is either. But I'm gonna pick it up. I'm gonna take it. Because it's out in the... No one's guarding it. And it's mine. I'm gonna take that as well. I'm just gonna take everything. I'm gonna go crazy! Alright, I'm gonna craft myself a pickaxe. Because we need that... Oh. We need that pickaxe so that we... Can smash down this rock. We're gonna need as many rocks as we can possibly get. Now we need the bigger sort of boat. Oh, it's getting night time. We're gonna need the bigger boulders so that we can actually get ourselves some. Are you are you kidding me? I'm actually filled up already. Okay then. I've got enough grass. It's getting night time, guys. We do not want to get caught out at night time without a fire. But I haven't found enough gold. I love gold. I can't seem to find the gold. Okay, I'm not going to keep heading. I'm going to stick with the pigs. I reckon the pigs will protect me. Them, them crazy pigmen. They'll keep us alive. What do you reckon, guys? Do you reckon that's the Minecraft equivalent of uh, of the zombie pigmen? I reckon it is. Look at the cute little houses they got. Alright. Let's craft ourselves a fire for the first night. We're going to need it. Okay. It's a pity I'm not a big bad wolf, because I'd huff. And I'd puff. And I'd blow that little wooden shack down. Yes, I would. And I'd collect all the loot because I'm a hoarder. I collect everything I possibly can. So, let's see what else we can make whilst we're going to survive. See, this is the first thing we need. We need a science machine. Pretty badly. But, it's not good because I've already filled up my inventory. Which is pretty bad. So what I'm going to do, what you have to do, actually, is cook up the foods and stuff like that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cook this. I've got nowhere to put it. Oh, I've already filled up my inventory. This is what you get for being a hoarder, guys. This is what you get. Oh, whoa. What's going on? No, no, no. I need... No. Oh, <laughs> well, that's never happened before. Oh, I'd say hello to myself. Kids, don't play with fire. That is not... What, what do you do with ashes? I might as well just drop them. Okay. We've already learned a valuable lesson. Is not to try and cook berries on an open fire because apparently that doesn't work but we'll try and cut down some more trees whilst we've still got time because we've only got two logs of wood and I need a lot more wood than that the first thing we need to try and do really guys is find we, we can't set up camp in our official home until we find some gold we need some gold so that we can actually make our first science machine I think it's called a science machine let's take a look it is called, yes, a science machine, and that is essentially your Minecraft crafting bench. You know in Minecraft where you, you try and craft something on your person, you ain't got that many options, and then you build a crafting bench and you could craft everything? Exact same principle. Now this is already, this is what I'm talking about guys, you see where it's all dark around us? I don't like this, I don't like, I'm going to put something on the fire. Yeah, night time is bad time. You don't want to go out at night time because there's loads of stuff out there that will kill you and you can't see where it's even attacking you from. So we're going to stay here, we're going to wait it out for our first day. We're coming to the end of the first day guys, so we're already on the journey to a professional don't starve us. Because we survived the first night. <laughs> it gets a lot harder. Now I know you can survive literally as long as possible. I think like I've seen someone playing it before and they heat something like 200 days. Something like that, so they're obviously uh, a lot better than what we are. But we're going to try and at least make it a day 20 on our first little playthrough. We're going to try. Now, I have played this game before. As I said at the beginning, I played it before and we got to about 22. And that's when winter came in. Now, winter is an unforgiving time. You need to craft, uh, craft yourself like wooden uh, wool earmuffs. You need to craft yourself like a, a puffy jacket and stuff to make sure you stay warm. Oh, it's it's unforgiving, it really is. You can't even grow crops. You can't do anything. This is not nice. So we've got to try and get prepared for winter. Now your food, your food and stuff like that. Oh, I just ate that completely. Now your food, you cook up and stuff like that. And 
Oh, day two! We made it to day two! Hello. Whoa! Would you? There's a lot of pigs around here, man. That's crazy. So we're gonna head up north. Why not head up north way? And see if we can't find ourselves some rocks. So we can cut down the rocks. We're gonna try. We're gonna try and cut down some rocks. But well, that doesn't look like a friendly place at all. So we're gonna stay away from that. Oh yes, 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 yes. I'll take that. I will take that cut stone. Cause that. Oh. Oh, what did I do? Oh, I'm already full. Oh, 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 I need more space already. That's not good. Um. Oh, some more logs. I guess we might as well pick that up. Oh, this isn't good. This isn't good at all. We need rocks. Not these sort of rocks. They're the big boulders that we can smash and we get gold out of them. Oh, we need them bad. We need them bad, guys. We haven't got that many days that we could survive potentially without it. We need to be able to craft that soon. I think, knowing my luck, I've headed in the wrong direction. Completely. We need... We need uh, some boat. That's the wrong sort of boulder. I don't know what that is, but I'm going to smash it anyway. Because I want the stuff that's in there. I don't know what's in there. <laughs> it's a plug sinkhole. Okay, we're not going down there, wherever that is. But we are going to take all the stuff that we just smashed. Let's keep heading down. Oh, we have to find some bonus suit, guys. We're going to take this food because we're going to need as well. Oh, I've got no space. And this is not fair. I'm going to eat a mushroom. Do not do that in real life because that's not good. But we're going to keep heading down this way. Let's see if we can, we've got to find something. No, mate, I'm walking absolutely everywhere other than the place where the boulders are. Now, we're heading back on ourselves, back towards that big fat pig. We're going to see... I'm going to see if I can't trade anything with you, actually. I know that you can trade stuff with the character. Shall we see if we can't... Does he want this box thing? Does he want this garden gnome? I guess we'll find out. I'm going to try and give him the gnome. Uh, I'm pretty... He might, he might accept it. He might want it. We'll find out. Here he is. King of the pigs. Hey, Oink, would you like, uh, would you like this garden gnome? Oh, we <laughs> Yes! We needed this! We <laughs> now we don't need to find rocks! Oh, I hit the jackpot on that one. Does he want this? Oh, no, apparently he doesn't want that. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. So we're gonna... Whilst we've still got time... Cut down as much... We are lumberjacks. We're gonna cut down as much trees as we can today. So our profession for the day is bah, 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 lumberjacks. We need to try and get as much wood as possible. Yep, let's cut this down as well. Bigger the tree, the bigger the yield. Yay. Hopefully, we can get ourselves sorted with a new camp real soon. Now, I want to find a buffalo. Now, you guys haven't bumped into these yet, obviously, in this playthrough. But, there are these little uh, buffalo things that walk around. And they poo all over the place. And do you know what? We need that poo. Yes, we do. We need that poo. We need that poo so that we can fertilize some plants, create our own little gardens, and we can grow our own little crops. Now, that is a fun thing to do. You'll be able to make a little crop pot. You'll be able to, like, a, a little cooking pot, and you'll be able to, uh... Cut, ooh, some food over there. Yeah, you, you make a crop pot. You stick all your foods in there, and you cook yourself things like ratatouille. Uh, some meaty bars and stuff like that. It's pretty cool, man. It's pretty cool. Oh, I just walked past the cat. Oh, no. No! Oh, this, this is not good, Phoenix. Eat it. Eat it. Eat that. There's that, there's that giant turkey thing. I will catch you before Christmas, man. I promise you that. Just keep heading down this way. It's getting dusk. It's getting dusk. Oh, there's some more pet. Oh, wow. Now, this looks like a place we are setting up camp. Full stop. Because look at that. We've got all these carrots and we've got berry bushes that keep growing berries back. Oh, that's good. That's good, that's good, that's good. And we've got all these um, tufts of grass as well that we can collect. Oh, this is like resource central, this is. Oh, I can't wait. So this is definitely where we're going to live amongst the pigs. We're going to be at one with the pigs. Come on, come on. Come here, Peter. Oh, I've got the monster. Oh, oh, what's going on? Hey, yeah. No, don't follow me, buddy. Go away. No, don't get away from me. Hey, stop, stop following me. Why is it still following me? Okay, we got away. 
<laughs> we do not want that happening again. Um, okay, so we need more trees still. Where, where do we want to set up camp? We don't want to set up too close to where the pigs are. Because I'm not sure if they're friendly or not. They seem friendly to begin with. Well, we don't know that. They could they could get hit by lightning if it's anything like Minecraft. Turn into zombie pigmen. So, what we will do... Oh, do you know what? Do you know what? We're going to set up camp... No, we're not going to set up camp next to a grave. <laughs> we don't know what's going to come out of that grave. Um, okay, we're going to set up camp here. Right here. So we are going to craft our very first science machine. Now we can craft ourselves. Uh, oh no, I ain't got enough rocks. Oh, I need rocks now. Oh, this, is, this is unforgiving, this game. Right, we're going to have to... Build ourselves a campfire. We're gonna put pine cones on the campfire. Just take them all. I don't want them pine cones. Just take them all. <laughs> and the first thing we're gonna do on day three is head out and try and collect as many rocks as we possibly can. Because we are six rocks short of creating our next thing that we need to make. I'm pretty sure. We need a permanent fire pit. Because that will go out and disappear eventually. It will turn into ash. Uh, no, 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 Phoenix, what are you doing? It's getting night time. Here we go. Here we go, guys. It's another time. Now, I can't make anything that I properly want to make yet. Because we are going to need to make a chest. We're going to need a chest to put some stuff in. We're going to need to make. Uh, is it? Yeah, a backpack really need to make that backpack but we're one we're one resource short of each oh, that's not fair what's this down here ooh fire plays if only I could catch them okay so we're coming to the end of day two at least we've got ourselves a couple of cut rock which is good oh, if only that wasn't cut we'd be able to make the thing that we wanted <gasps> we need a backpack and we need a chest really bad this isn't good! <laughs> Just running around so cool. Oh, I certainly don't need to carry this. We're going to have to drop some stuff to make sure that we have space so that we can actually gather some resources on the next day. Now we're going to eat these because our food is not looking so well. There goes our hunger bar. Hunger bar. Oh, it's almost at full. We're going slightly insane. <laughs> You're right. In the top right corner, you can see. The, uh, the three dots, we've got one which is like a stomach, that's our, our hunger bar. We've got the next one next to it which is the heart, which is our actual health. And the one beneath it is our brain. Now that brain, you do not want to head down. That's probably one of, well, if, obviously if you lose the health, you die. If you lose the hunger, you start losing health. But if you lose the brain, you start going insane. You literally start seeing ghosts and stuff walking around the place. Some big scary creatures walking around the place and that's not what we want to happen within the first few days of playing trust me it's pretty funny all the same sometimes you actually need to go insane oh, there's a rock it seems we've struck gold not literally guys but we have struck rock and we needed this rock pretty badly so we'll smash that up we're gonna take all these rocks okay that's flint i don't need whatever that was nitra nitra was that Nitra? What's it called? Where'd it go? There. Nitra. Nitra. Whatever you want to call it. Apples and pears, man. I don't know what that is. We're going to find out eventually what that does, I guess. Ah, oh, there's another one. There's another one. Okay. So we'll cut that down. What are we on now? What are we on? How many rocks we got? How many rocks? Twelve. That's exactly what we needed. Okay, I can't remember what we were going to build, but we needed that. We also need grass. Have we spotted any grass yet? Come on. Where's all the grass be, man? Oh, no. That doesn't look like a nice place to be. I'm not heading that way. Yeah. I don't know what's in here. What is this place? D well, I know they're not through. <laughs> yeah, we're not going through there, guys. Apparently, giant tentacles live there. We're going to get out of there and we're not coming back. We need a little bit more grass. I don't. I can't find it anywhere. There's, there's like spiders nest. I'm pretty sure there's spiders nests all around the place. We've got sticks. There's plenty of sticks. 
Oh, I remember where the grass was now. There's some grass there. The, the grass was up at that last place. The last place with all the pigs, wasn't it? Oh, Phoenix, you gone forgot that already, man. You were rambling on so much, you actually forgot that you just walked past some grass a minute ago. <laughs> so this is where the pigs are. Is this where the resort? Ah, oh, it is here. We, we do not have to worry about food for at least the first couple of days with all these berry bushes here and stuff like that. We have got some good resources to survive the first few nights in the game, which is awesome. So what we're going to do now is make ourselves a permanent fire pit. Oh yes. Oh, I can't put it there. Okay, we'll put it there then. And then what's the next thing on the agenda? We need to see if we can't make... I guarantee I do not have enough resources. Right, we've got enough time left in a day. Two. Okay, we need another axe. <laughs> that had 1% health on it, that axe. We need to cut down as many trees as we possibly can before night falls. So that we can make ourselves a chest, we can store the stuff that we don't need to carry in a chest. We also need enough grass so that we can make a backpack. That's the very next thing that I really want to do, because backpack, more inventory space, we need that. We need that, because we're already running out of space, because we're hoarding everything we can find. <laughs> so... Let's cut down as many trees as possible. We've got enough time left in the day. See if we can't make it. It's almost coming to the end of daytime or day three. By the end of daytime or day three, I think we should have enough to be able to survive the night, craft our chest, and we should be good. These trees, the bigger the tree, the more it takes to chop down. But the more logs you get out of it. Now, if we had, a, if we made a shovel, we could come back and dig up all them stumps in the floor and get ourselves an extra log. So. We're not wasting resources. Let's just keep cutting down as much as we can. It's coming towards the end of day three, and by dusk, I wouldn't mind getting back to base, getting that chest built, and we should be good. It should be the last three. We shouldn't need any more than 20. I'm certain. I'm certain we don't need more than 20. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying the game so far. I'm going to be playing this. I'm going to do our little walkthrough. You guys can advise me if there's anything you guys would want me to do. I'm pretty clueless at the game, so I'm learning. You guys are learning. <laughs> We're all learning. Let's get this chest built. Restore the, the stuff we don't need. Is it free that I need? Yes. Yes, we've got our first chest. I'm going to put it right there. Yay. So what are we going to do? We're going to... Oh, wrong button. Oh, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Xbox. I gotta get used to ye. Okay, open and store. There we go. We're storing stuff in here that we don't need. We don't need these pine cones right now. We've got. Oh, why is them two stacks split? We do not need hmm, this nitra or whatever you want to call it. We do not need that. We'll drop this on the floor and we are good. We have made it to mid. Day, day three, everybody. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed it so far. Oh, make sure you hit that like button. Leave us comments in the description if you're enjoying it or things that you'd like to see me do in this game if you're familiar with the game. And I shall catch you all in the next episode. See you later.